I didn't mean to push that. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, that was interesting. That doesn't work. As I expected. Also using a hyper blaster. Whatever it is. The blaster when I don't need to. Okay. I think they gave an option to have all your ammo listed on the side, which is unfortunate. What is my grenade? I don't know. Ew. Dang it. FPS is kind of brutal. Unless it's only because it's locked at 60. <laughs> There's no way this doesn't look like 60. This is definitely 30 or something. Ah, that's... I'm blind. Stupid. Disappointed with this new aim system. My pull. What is my right? Because it doesn't allow me to bind the asterisk on the keypad. Another disappointment. So I change my binds. How does the original have it, and this game doesn't? I don't understand. Oh, that was interesting. Wait a second. What in the world? Is that how bunny hopping works in Quake 2? Is it just straight? I'm pretty sure there's... Funny happening, not just straight jumping. I am so confused right now. That would be a huge mistake. So I don't think they would do it. I think that's too good for that. Especially when I think it helped them with some stuff. That's the way it do I care about secrets? Particularly. It's two of them. I don't think changing your crosshair will change the way the gun works. That would be interesting. Also a very odd choice. Wow, 
interested. Audio is probably still too bad. Eh, maybe not. Never got close enough. Right. So that's what I had to do. Yeah. I don't know. I know I played Quake 1 after. Is it? Do I care? Should I just go to the next mission? Like Quake 1 after Quake 2, so maybe I'm just wishing it had the bunny hopping, that air control. But I'm going. It is next mission. Kinda. Of. It's a long enough video.